Hey guys, Katie here. I just finished reading Gorgeous by Paul Rudnick. Um, I wasn't that impressed with this book. It's a young adult book. Uh, it, it's about this girl who's 18. She just graduates high school. Her name's Becky Randall and her mother dies. And while she's going through her mother's things, she finds a ring box that has a phone number in the bottom of it. So she calls it and Tom Kelly answers. And Tom Kelly is like Calvin Klein or Tommy Hilfiger or something like that. that that's like the equivalent. He's this famous designer and he has all these different perfumes and clothes and blah blah blah. So she flies out to New York to meet him and he wants to strike a deal with her. He will make her the most beautiful woman in the world when he makes three dresses for her. A red dress, a white dress, and a black dress. She doesn't understand how this is really going to happen, but she decides to go for it anyway, like, whatever. So she, they, they make her the red dress and she tries it on and she figures out that when somebody else is in a room with her, she, her body completely transforms. Like she's five inches taller, she's thinner, beautiful, has like poreless skin, just really unbelievable models are jealous. But when she's alone, she goes back to being Becky. So when she's beautiful, she's Rebecca. And when she's normal, she's Becky. And it just continues like that. And then the end of the first day of her wearing this dress and being beautiful and everybody wanting to know who is she and Tom Kelly's come out of retirement because he's been retired for 20 years and nobody's seen him and blah, blah, blah. That Tom Kelly tells her she has to fall in love and get married within a year to remain her beautiful Rebecca self. So that's kind of the premise of the story, her trying to get married and fall in love and stay beautiful and like there's a lot of fallout from that. The book was a lot more, I guess, supernatural than I thought it would be. I didn't really know what to expect with it and I didn't like it. It was too twisty, I guess, and hard to grasp. I, I just really didn't like it at all. Um, I wouldn't recommend it, but unless you like, I guess, supernatural romance YA books about normal girls becoming beautiful. So my next book that I just started, it is One Last Thing Before I Go by Jonathan Troper. Proper, I'm not real sure. But um, yeah, I'll let you know how that is in a couple of days and I'll see you later. Bye.